Thank you for choosing the Dake FG75 as your belt grinder. In this video, we'll take a look at how to change the belt and adjust the belt tracking. The first step is to loosen the front panel captured Allen screws. And then next, we'll remove the stock rest and the debris catch tray. On the side of the machine, you'll find the belt tension relief handle. So if you give a good strong pull upward on that handle, it will compress the spring and allow you to take off the belt. To remove the belt, we'll pull up on the lever and hold it up while sliding the belt off. To reduce the chance of a belt splitting at the seam, you'll want to make sure to replace the belt with a correct rotation. Here you can see the back of the belt with arrows indicating travel direction. And those arrows should be facing opposite. The one on the belt should be facing opposite of the one on the machine. Place the new belt onto the machine and pull up on the belt tension relief handle and slide the new belt onto the drum rollers. Now we can adjust the belt tracking by using an Allen wrench and we're going to loosen the set screw on the tracking knob. Now you can plug in and turn on the grinder. Turn the tracking knob right or left and watch for how the belt moves on the rollers. In this case, we'll just leave our belt in the middle. And the last step is to make sure you retighten the set screw. Next, we can reinstall the debris catch tray and the stock rest. Now you can close the body cover and make sure everything is good and tight. Well, we hope this video has been helpful to you for your FG75. And if you have any questions or need more information, you can look us up on the web at decor.com or give us a call at 1-800-937-3253.